All right, this video is on, listen guys and gals, we all know how to trade trend. Everybody knows how to trade trend. How do we trade chop? Okay, how do you trade chop? The best way to do it, we know with our arrow system, it finds a sweet spot in the market. Trend days, we had a huge day yesterday, huge day Wednesday, big day Monday too on the arrow system. Look at the last video, how to trade the markets. How to trade the system you can see some of our trades were really explosive so but how do you trade chop remember when you first log in we want to look at this magenta ma look at the magenta ma that's going to tell if we're chop or trend if it's sideways or horizontal we're not in the trend we're in a chopper range market typically we trend three and we chop two during the week on pretty much all markets so what you want to do is is that if you are if you are flat the the trend filter right here that's built into market profile you can see it sideways or flat sideways if it's flat or sideways horizontal and you are in a range market then you're in a range or flat market what you want to do is i would not play with the arrows we want to play with the arrows because they get us into the sweet spot in the market on a Retracement. Well, if you're not trending, the retracement, you have to be very careful where you're buying and selling. So what we want to do is we want to buy the low, sell the high. And the best way to do it is that on trend days, the easiest way is to take the arrows on the first retracement, full retracement. We got a couple videos how to do that. Just check out our last two videos. What do you do on chop? You want to avoid the middle. We always trade this blue line that's the most volume that's traded in the market on trend days. If we're angled down on this magenta MA, and I'm talking about an angle, you'll see an angle, you know, angled down like this. You know, you, you, you'll see a steep angle where it's angled down like this. You see that steep angle? That's a trend day. It's just an easy way to get short the market. Just take arrow shorts. It's trend. But when you chop sideways, you want to sell the high by the low. So the best way to do it is, is avoid the middle, avoid the blue line, avoid the middle, and sell by the outer edges. So we want to avoid this, avoid the middle, sell the outer edge, buy the outer edge. This is three times market profile confluence at the low, two times market profile confluence at the high. Sell red, buy green on the first and second test. Right after I told the guys and gals that's what we want to do in the market, it came right up to it, stopped almost to the tick on my market profile. We get a negative market delta, and the market went back down. Then it came back down, tested my profile again, positive market delta, came right back up. That's this is what you want to do. Only play market profile with market delta in range or chop markets. Once we get a range extension outside of HVA and LVA, meaning we bust down through LVA or bust out of HVA, then you look for the first error retracement by yourself. And that typically will catch it. Okay, so that's how we trade shop. We know how to trade trend. Just play our last video, how to trade the system. And uh, you'll, you'll see how we trade trend days. But chop days, if that magenta MA when you first log in is sideways or horizontal on any market you trade, sell HVA by LVA on the first and second test of it. Then wait for a breakout, and then try to get into the first error retracement.